this text needs to be in two columns. Select it. Layout. Columns. More columns. Two. And the spacing between the columns must be 0 0.6 centimeters. Correct. I'm going to use column break to ensure that both of the subheadings are at the top. Put my mouse in front of that heading and I'm going to go here, layout breaks, column break. Yeah, that's correct. Now I'm going to scroll down to Pafada. I need to insert an image here. Insert picture. That is the picture, the picture of the Pafada. The image of the Pafada must be the same size as the image of the Black Mamba. The Black Mamba is 2.78 centimeters. Let me select the Pafada and change that there to 2.78 centimeters. Now this image needs to be at the side with text wrapped on the left. Select the image, wrap text, square. There, the text is now on the left. I need to supply this image with a caption, which reads figure 2 Pafada. Select the image. Go to References, Insert Caption, Puff Adder. Correct. Now the text on the brown house snake must be removed from this document. Select it, Control X to remove it. It must go into another file, and the file is called the Brown House Snake. Open the file, press Ctrl V and paste it in. Save. Let me go back to my main file. There. Now this table must be in Landscape. Because it must be in landscape, I'm going to separate from the rest of the document with a section break. I'm going to go to layout, break, section break. And then I'm going to make the orientation landscape. So just this is in landscape and the page after it is not. But this table must be on one page. No, I'm going to go to Margins. There, it's on one page, correct. 